Hi friends, and welcome to our Read Aloud. Today we're gonna read another story about school. How's school going for you? Is it good? Is it a little scary still? Which one? Very good. I think mine is going very good because I've been so excited to meet you and that y'all have been doing some great work on Schoology. So thank you so much and keep it up. Now we're gonna read a story about a mouse. And this story is called, If You Take a Mouse to School. <gasps> That's interesting. Do you think that this story is real or make-believe? Yeah, I think it's make-believe too. Because can you really take a mouse to school? No, that would be so silly. Would you ever see a mouse in overalls carrying a pencil? No, what a silly mouse. So this book is a make-believe book, but in this book, our mouse, he does go to school, okay? And I don't know, let's think. What do you think, when you look at the cover, what do you think the mouse is going to do at school? Can you name one thing? So we're gonna have to read to find out if you're correct, but I think maybe that could happen, so great job. Now let's find out. And during this, I want you to think, okay? And think about if you were right, if the, if the mouse did what you thought it was gonna do, okay? This is called, If You Take a Mouse to School. If you take a mouse to school, he'll ask for your lunchbox. When you give him your lunchbox, he'll want a sandwich. And a snack for later. Then he'll need a notebook and some pencils. He'll probably want to share your backpack too. When you get to school, he'll put things in your locker and take a look around. Do you see him right there? He might do a little math and spell a word or two. He'll even try a science experiment. Then, He'll need to wash up. You'll have to take him to the bathroom. Once he's nice and clean, he'll be ready for his lunch. On the way to the cafeteria, he'll see some building blocks. He'll build a little mouse house. and make some furniture out of clay. Then he'll need some books for his bookshelf. He'll start by writing one of his own, so he'll need a lot of paper. He'll probably use up all your pencils, and when he's finished, he'll want to read his book to you. Then he'll want to take it home, so he'll put it in your lunchbox and tuck it in a safe place. When the bell rings, he'll run out to wait for the bus. While he's waiting, he'll play a quick game of soccer. Then he'll ask you to shoot a few baskets. and do a little skateboarding. When he stops to catch his breath, he'll want to eat his snack. So he'll ask you for your lunchbox. And chances are, if he asks you for his lunchbox, you'll have to take him back to school. The end.
How did you like that story? Give me a thumbs up if you like that story. Yeah, me too. Now let's go back to what you said in the beginning. Did, did what you think he was gonna do at school happen? Yeah, so what are some things he did at school? Can you tell Ms. Balasha one thing that he did at school? You are right, he did all kinds of things at school. He played with blocks, he wrote a book, he, he, what, he ate lunch, all kinds of things that you're gonna do at school too. Thank you for joining me. Keep on going for your Schoology lessons.